All right, for this video, we're gonna tell you a little bit about protein and how we incorporate it into our day, along with a few other important things. Okay, let's go. Hey, Charity. Hey, Devin. We're here in front of this camera again. Let's talk about something exciting that we're going to do this month. Oh, yeah, this month. Our challenge. Our protein challenge. Yeah, so we're doing a challenge on protein to help people just test themselves, see how they're doing on nutrition, specifically consuming protein, right? Yeah, and for us being nutrition coaches, getting enough protein is one of our foundational components to, um, for our clients, what we teach. It's how we live. We think it's important for longevity, health, being strong, and um, just maintaining um, good general fitness. That's right. And for example, today, it's a Sunday morning, beautiful day. So we thought, let's get out and no reason to go to the gym when it's this nice out. So we just got done running. That's why I'm wet. Are you? We didn't just run. We ran the stairs. We did. Oh, yeah. We did some other stuff too. So we did our exercise. We haven't had anything to eat yet. It's 10 in the morning or so. And we did that on purpose. We like to exercise fasted sometimes and just for change up. Um, That might be for you, might not be. But most importantly, we're going to talk about what we're going to do when we get home. We're going to refuel. Oh, can we get home already? I'm hungry. (laughs) So what's typical for us trying to hit those protein targets of, you know, up near one gram of protein per pound of ideal body weight is typically what our goal is, right? Yep. What we teach our clients to get after. Yeah. And I think for me, uh, eating three meals, dividing it evenly, you know, for me, 120 grams of protein a day. So dividing it evenly into three portions of 40 grams. Plus I know that usually hits the leucine threshold. We'll talk about that later, but, um, so just dividing those evenly. So knowing what I'm going to have and making sure I get enough protein in each meal every time I eat. That's good. And so today, what do you think you're going to have when you get home? We don't have anything prepared today. We don't, but, um, oh, I don't know. Maybe a egg and chicken, um, breakfast burrito. Oh, that'd be good. Can I have one? Can you make me one too? He needs two. Yeah. So in my case, I think I want to be 220 pounds. I'm nowhere near that, but that's typically what I eat from a protein perspective. I, you know, that's my ideal body weight, um, in my mind. So for me, I'll get home and I'll make a protein shake. I have those many mornings, probably five days out of seven, depending on what's going on. And that protein shake has whey protein in it, um, a couple scoops, as well as, um, either a high protein milk or a, um, somewhat almond milk we use as well. And some other components of it that get it up to around 70 or 80 grams of protein for my first um, dose, as I like to call it, of protein for the day. I like to treat it like I'm a lab rat sometimes and make sure I get the right food, the right macronutrients. Yes, get that whey protein in quick um, so it starts repairing your muscles and um, rebuilding all the damage we just did out here. Running. Yeah, so keep listening, keep watching. We're going to talk more about protein and why it works for you nutritionally, and and really, it's not about being a bodybuilder, is it? I want to be a bodybuilder. No, you don't. I okay. just <laughs> want to be strong when I'm eating and yeah. be able to chase after you. It's the long, it's the long <laughs> game we're talking about here. So we want people to be um, healthy and feeling like they could do everything they want to do when they're 50, 60, 70, 80 years old. And if you're 30 or 40 and not feeling great about yourself or not feeling like you could do what you want now, it doesn't get easier. Um, but it's never too late to get started. So. So keep watching channels like ours. Keep looking for ways to get better. And ultimately, it's nutrition and exercise. We want you to live amped just like we do. That's it. So go ahead, live amped. Talk to you next time.